Yo, what's going on, guys? Welcome back to Minecraft. We are back in the world of Mandem World Dem. Immediately after losing all of our fucking shit. So, Lava. I still haven't reviewed the footage le um, yet of last episode. This is literally, I've just recorded this right after I've done died. What? The fuck was that? Right after I died, I just fucking slapped some iron shit on and then recorded this pretty much. There. I'm pretty sure I either left off. I either got up and threw my character in some water, which led to lava, or I just left my character to get knocked into lava by some fucking creature, like something knocked me into lava somehow. Which is an absolute fucking piss take, like the only, like the, it took, <coughs> literally I left for about two fucking seconds and the minute I come back I'm just dead in lava, and for some reason even when I left the game and joined like, I left the game without saving, even though even though I left the game without saving, I came back and I was just, it somehow just immediately saved the second I died, for some fucking reason. It's so dumb, why does it save when you die? That's like the worst time for a game to save. Why does it save when you bloody die? That is so dumb. Like, I, I've been playing this game before and I've been, I, I've built up my whole house and shit and then I'll just exit the game without saving by accident. I come back and my whole house is back to fucking shit again because I didn't save it when I actually, like, after I've done building it. But now, when I die and lose all my diamond shit, it decides to fucking save, like, oh my god. But we got lots of food, we got lots of iron shit, um, I'm going to dedicate this episode to going into caves and finding diamonds and hopefully fucking upgrading my shit again. Because that's what I wanted to do last episode, I wanted to actually get a shit ton of fucking diamonds and upgrade my house and stuff but obviously I got fucking smoked so oh, I'm gonna have to do this dumb shit again I don't know how this episode's gonna turn out because I don't know if I'll find something I might find something cool while in the fucking caves or it might just be boring and I'm just roaming around for fucking diamonds the whole time yeah man it's gonna be fucking annoying it's gonna be a long episode I'm just gonna re I'm just gonna take a bunch of wheat so I can make bare bread because I can't be asked to go out hunting for animals right now so I'm just gonna replant all this shit and I'm gonna go out right to a cave. I don't know what fucking cave to go to. I might go back to the one I was in, if I could even find it again. I lost my fucking map as well, which is such a mistake. But it's fine, I could just take a copy off the wall. I can use the cartography table. I think I might have a piece of paper lying around somewhere. Hopefully I can use that to go copy the map and then take another one from there. So fuck's sake, there's three zombies outside waiting for me as well. The fuck you touching, man? Slapping my ass, bro. Stupid prick. Oh, whole farm's done. This is the first time I've actually been able to plant wheat on the whole farm. Ah, fuck. So pissed off. Fuck. Slapping my ass with an iron spade, you absolute pussy. Fuck off. Hate you all. Level two, yes. Hopefully I level up when I'm fucking out so I can actually upgrade my fucking tools that I might get i don't even know it's not even certain that i might even get diamonds i might just come back with two fucking pieces pieces of coal no i'm so pissed off i need to make some bread fucking hell, how much bread can i make huh. pretty good i can put this in the composter actually i'll put this in the nature box and maybe put it in the composter they are do you guys say compost or compost i say compost i think americans say compost that sounds weird, compost. It sounds like you're taking the piss. Would you like some compost? Have I got any coal? Yeah, I've got a bit. Hmm. I'm so pissed off, man. I was bathing in fucking diamonds and coal and all that mad shit, but now I'm back here again with jack shit. So annoyed, man. You guys do not understand. The thing is, recently, I used to get angry at that shit, like really angry. Recently, I've come to terms with myself and stuff <clears throat> and in controlling my anger and stuff instead instead of dwelling and crying about what the fuck just happened i think about what i'm going to do next because you can't change the past it's fact you can't change the past you can't change what just happened you can cry about it all you want but that's only gonna um oh what oh shit i'm gonna have to make another map and i i think i have to make another map how do i make another map Empty map. I need fucking... How much is that? Nine paper. Yeah, okay. I'll just take this fucking one then. I don't care. Uh, um, yeah, it's better, it's better to just sit down and come to terms with what just happened and think about what to do next. If anything bad ever happens to you, 
You can sit there and cry about it, cry about it all you want, but all you're doing is wasting time and evoking, invoking uh, negative emotions onto your brain, which isn't going to be good for your mental health. So you just got to fucking. I don't. I don't think it's good to either just ignore your problems either. Like if something just happens, is it good for your? Is it good for your brain to just accept it? Aren't you meant to let out emotions sometimes? I don't know, man. I'm pretty sure repressed anger t uh, converts into depression, right? But that doesn't really happen much for me. I don't think, anyway. Okay, well, I can make a map now. I've just got a bunch of paper. Should be sighty. But yeah, like what just happened then, instead of throwing my controller at the ground and punching up my pillows and screaming, which is what I wanted to do, I sat there and I thought, you know what, I'm just going to evoke all of my emotion into getting all that shit back instead of just sitting down giving up and crying about it i'm gonna use all my anger to get back to where i was all the energy that i just built up in my body after losing all my shit um i've just fucking used it fuck can i place it in there no that's the wrong map that's one in there. look how butt is that is man that's not even a locator map. I mean, I guess I know I'm there, but... That looks so bad. Why is the corner just not there either? Fuck. Okay. Make an empty map. Don't use the map. Copy map. Oh. Wasn't that easy? That was just... Wasn't that just easy? Wasn't that just really easy? Why do I have a bunch of shit there? Okay, whatever. Right, time to fucking head out and smash up some diamonds with my pickaxe, man. <sighs> I put both the fucking... I don't know what to use clay for, because clay is only used for bricks, I think. There might be something new they added, which you can use clay for, but... That's all I know right now you can use clay for. Wait, well, that doesn't even make fucking sense. I can't speak, man. Um, yeah, I only know that you can use... The only thing I know you can use clay for is bricks right now. So, I don't, I don't really want to use bricks against anything. Look how slow and pathetic that is. Look, only one coal per, per block. Ugh. Man, I miss my fucking shit, man. I miss my shit, dude. See, honestly, if this cave even comes to, um... Because I'm so desperate to find diamonds right now. If this cave is a dead end, I'm just going to dig sh uh, straight down. And then make a little mine shaft. Just so I can extract some diamonds from somewhere. I can't be able to linger in caves anymore, man. Ugh. What are you guys doing today? How was your day today? I hope it was alright. Well, it depends when you're watching this, really. My day's been alright so far. I woke up, had a nice... It's Sunday night today. I mean, it's Sunday night. It's Sunday today, so... It's a nice break from school. Because we don't have school on weekends. I don't know who has school on weekends. Maybe people that go fucking Saturday school or some shit. I remember I had to go Saturday school. In year six. Which was... It wasn't that bad actually because it was only two hours. And it was just basic shit like maths and English. We just had to do a little bit of revision. It was really basic actually. I'm pretty sure it was just addition and subtraction. In maths, and then English, we just had to write poems for our parents and then show them when we get home. Nothing that crazy. Man, primary school was so cool for me. I live in England, so I don't have fucking um, kindergarten and fucking, uh, what's it called? Secondary school and shit like that. I have, I have, I have um, nursery, primary school, and then... It should really, well and truly be called secondary school, but we just call it fucking uh, high school. Don't know why. It'll make sense, because primary, secondary, but instead we just, we want to be different. I was thinking before. Oh, for fuck's sake, is that the end of me? No. Nope. You're done, no, it's not the end of me. Yeah, primary school is so sick, man. I made so many good friends, so many good memories in there, so many cool games we played, so many cool things we did. I love all the teachers. Actually, no, I didn't like any of the teachers, except for, like, one or two. Hmm. This high school, this year in high school has been alright. I mean, I mean, um, high school in general has been alright. Um, most of my friends from primary school actually went to the same high school as me, so I'm, I'm pretty fortunate to have that. Pretty cool. I don't really like hanging out in big... I'm not, I'm not one of them cool kids in our school, because to, to be a cool kid, you've got to be really Im immature 
dumb and really aggressive, which is not me. I don't want to be like that ever. So I, I prefer to hang around with my small little group of friends. And I feel like the smaller your group of friends is, the more you can connect with each person in your friend group, if you know what I mean. The more you can sort of talk to each other and grow your relationships. Where if you, if you just have some fucking big friend group, you're not really going to have as much individual time with um, each individual, individual person as you'd want to, if you know what I mean. Oh, fucking hell, hello. Straight down to fucking lava. Look at this shit. But yeah, guys, definitely in the future, I'm definitely going to do some videos with my friends. Because I want you guys to meet them. And I think we can do some cool shit together, honestly. Because I feel like me by myself is kind of getting a bit boring. So, I like to introduce some new people to the channel, you know. I need to remember to talk slower as well. That's one of my things I need to focus on. Talking slower. So you can understand what the fuck I'm saying. Because I get that all the time. I'll be talking to someone. I'll be like, sorry, what the fuck? Can you say that again, please? And I'll be like, oh. And they're like, sorry, what the fuck? Can you say that again, please? And then they end up just, like, p pretending to know what I said and going, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Even though I'm, I've asked them the question, like, how old are you or something? And they're like, <laughs> yeah, yeah. Be cool. Gaming videos, I prefer gaming videos that are doing them dumb skit videos that I used to do on my, um, on my old channel, Manda Mason. Uh, because with those old skit videos, you had to sit down and come up with a clever idea and story for all the shit. Whereas in this, you can just sit down like play some games speak to like say whatever comes to your fucking mind it's, it's amazing man i like this shit hopefully i do some get some sort of recognition for it when i'm older and start to develop some sort of fan base because i wouldn't mind doing this as a job man this is so cool and it's possible nowadays so why not fucking go for it am i right but when i'm my aspiration to be when i'm older is either a boxer or or a fucking personal trainer or something or or like i said a youtuber because um in i've been training in boxing for the couple for the past like year and i'm going to be carry on doing the training in in college and then in college i might also train in basketball as well i kind of want to do media i kind of want to like take a course in media in college as well because i feel like that will help me with my youtube and all that shit but I don't know. I don't know what the whole thing is about that. I don't know if you can do multiple things in college. I think you can, but in boxing and basketball training and sport training in general uh, requires a lot of time and dedication. So I don't think even if you could take multiple things um, in college, I don't think I'd have the time anyway to be able to do media as well as boxing. Oh fuck! I'm at bedrock already. As well as boxing and basketball and shit, because boxing's a fucking. You have to be very dedicated to be able to do boxing requires so much training um and yeah it, it just takes up lots of time so i don't think i'll have time anyway to do media unfortunately but i'm pretty sure after you've completed your course in college you can take another one so i might be looking at that you know i might do a little bit of media i mean entirely i don't know what media would actually do for me as a youtuber because i've pretty much done everything i can right now the only thing i can really improve on is getting better equipment, which just requires money. So I don't think taking media would give me... I don't think you really need ed education to do YouTube unless you're making films um, and editing shit. Whereas media teaches you how to advertise and make make films and all that shit, which I don't think I really need to do. So yeah, I don't think media is actually a smart choice. Man, I don't know if you can see... That tree outside my back window is just fucking going mental. It's just swaying like crazy. What the fuck's this lava doing, man? Move out of the way. You're kind of pissing me off now. Okay, I'm just... Gonna ignore that. I'm just gonna... Not go that way. Where the fuck's the lava? Here he is. Does this lead to anywhere, or is it... Oh, no, it's a natural cave. Cool. Nice. I want to hang low. I don't want to go up. Just so I can obtain some diamonds. I don't give a fuck about redstone or anything right now, man. I just want diamonds. Oh, hello. What's a zombie villager doing down here? Why is there two zombie villagers? What the fuck? That's so random. Oh, no. No, I'm not going through that fucking song and dance again. Fuck that. Hmm. Slap, slap. 
Nice. Pow, pow. Nice, nice, nice. Bear golden iron. Don't give a fuck about any of that shit. Shit. Any diamonds? I've lost some diamonds, actually. See all that gold and iron? Imagine all of that was just diamonds. That would be just amazing. I would love that. Imagine everything here is just fucking... Imagine all this stone was just diamonds. That would be sexy. Swim, you fat bastard. Come on. Come on, mate. There we go. Oh, fuck. I don't really want to go up, but... This might lead somewhere. With diamonds. Diamonds. Fucking diamonds. Here we are. This looks like... Oh, fuck off. Who that... Who the fuck? Where'd you come from, you absolute mug? Man, they increased the rate of fire of these skeletons, didn't they? Fucking hell. Oh, what the fuck's going on? Are they all onto me? Why does this guy... Oh, my God. I swear Notch is controlling my game right now. Look at that shit. That's nothing... There's nothing normal there. That does not naturally happen. Cool. I've placed cobblestone all around the water source. This game... Oh, my God. This day could not get any more worse for me, man. I don't know what the fuck to do against these people. Look at that shit. There they go. Now they're all going to scrap. There we go. Oh, you got fucked. Unlucky, geese. What if you got smoked? See, look at that IQ, man. I'm some smart guy. <coughs> Hello, lover. Oh, fuck. Death. Okay, okay, okay. Jack shit, my favourite. Jack, could you please shit some more? I'd love that. Oh, man, I'm getting angry. Nothing. I, will, I was going to go to the park today with my friends, but... I, I don't... Maybe, uh... I don't know if it's the right weather. It's legit the most fucking chaotic thing I've ever seen in my life. In England, we never get any natural disasters or any shit like any other country gets. Like, we don't get tornadoes, we don't get hurricanes, tsunamis, floods, snow. We don't even get fucking snow. This is like the craziest shit I've ever seen in England. It pretty much rains all the time, but it, no, it doesn't rain this heavily and it's nothing this windy. What the fuck's wrong with my voice, man? I know about this one day. Where are you going to lead? You're going to lead absolutely fucking nowhere. I'm going to dig down. Fuck this shit. I'm going to break every wall that Notch ever taught me. Oh, fuck. You know what? That's not a good idea. I just have flashbacks to falling in the lava, and I don't want to. I don't want that to happen again, to be honest with you. Holy fuck. I can't, I can't actually look out my window. What the fuck's going on? Is this like... Guys, this might be the last time you ever see me, you know? I feel like my fucking window's just about to cave in and then a tsunami's just going to flood my room and kill everyone. I can hear fucking... I can hear ambulances and police trucks and shit. What the fuck? It's absolutely mental right now, guys. Okay, I'm sorry that I'm... It's going a bit off track. Can you fucking see that shit? I don't know if you can hear my window. Wait, let me move my mic so you maybe can hear it next. Wait, let me open my window, actually, so you can hear the shit. Look at that. How's that for fucking England? Look at that fucking shit! What? Holy fuck. I'm sorry, guys. I've never seen shit like this in my fucking life. I'm just absolutely gobsmacked. I've never... What the fuck? Holy fuck! <laughs> I feel like the whole fucking world's about to blow up. 